Hey guys, if you saw my last video, you'll recognize this format. Uh, I'm going to try to sight read a piece that I've never played before or even looked at for more than a few seconds. So uh, the piece is Dragon the Seven by Ed Freytag from the Rudimental Cookbook. This piece is a medium level piece. So the advanced level did not go very well. Uh, we're gonna try medium in the hopes that uh, it goes quite a bit better. Although, who knows, we're gonna find out together. So uh, again, I've never seen it, playing it for the first time, just checking the sight reading ability and could be humorously bad, maybe it's gonna be good, we'll see. I'll try to put the notation on the screen over here, uh, which worked last time, I think. So why am I doing this? Well, because I have a book out, Subdivide and Conquer with Robert Miller. It's on Hudson Music and Amazon. It's all about reading, counting, and subdividing. So I thought I would see how my reading ability is. Let's hope that it's at least medium level because it sure isn't advanced. But here we go. It's a uh, two, four. The rolls aren't written out. They're just uh, tremolo notation. Well, let's see what we can do. That wasn't it. There it is. Okay, there's one page. So, I really messed up pretty bad in 16 and 17, but then when those rolls came back in 20 and 21, I think I kind of got them. So, at least there's that. Um, this is significantly easier to read than the advanced level piece. There's a piece in between these called medium advanced and maybe I'm going to try to do that one next because this seems pretty easy with the exception of really butchering some of those sevens that start on the beat. I think I got everything including the sticking. I mean you, you just saw it. Maybe I didn't but um, in my foggy recollection that was actually not too bad. Um, so thanks, Ed Freytag, something I can play. So there we go. Check out my book, Subdivide and Conquer, Hudson Music and Amazon.com, and that'll do it for today. Thanks for watching.